Hello, everybody. My name is Ultra Eric, a lot with Privacy J and the rest of the two bros. Today, we're going to be doing another episode of Gaming Suggestions, Episode 5. So today, we're going to discuss about greatest values about what games are you playing for the holiday season at a cheapest price. Let's say like under $59.99 or probably under $10. Like let's say to all my Nintendo members, my Nintendo members can also get a discount on games when you're like redeeming points like gold or platinum points. Right, folks? Yeah. 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 So, Elias, I know about um, greatest value. So, what games that can be played on the holiday season on the Nintendo Switch? Uh, I don't know. Let's go look it up. All right, we're going to share the screen right now, so let's look it up and see what it looks like. Yes. So today, we're going to show you guys Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield. Both of them are releasing right now. Overwatch did release, but not only that, we're going to show you guys Nintendo Switch games, $9.99 and under. If anyone has a Nintendo Isha card, make the most of it. These are all the games, like all of these, including Fortnite. Fortnite is actually the only game that is free. Zero dollars. And Toki Tori is actually four ninety nine. My and my game is also four ninety nine too. So everything else. And Sega Ages, Sonic the Hedgehog is seven ninety nine, right, Elias? That's your favorite game. Yes. Next is we're going to talk about is um, the Pokemon Shuffle and, uh, uh, I mean, Pokemon Sword and, and Shield. Now, Joshua, I know you know this, know these two games. So even though they could play it as a discount, they could play these two games? Yeah. Yep. You can buy them individually. Well, they have both in a combination. And it, it takes about storage. Let's also take a look at DLC's Ultimate Fighters Pass. So the Smash Brothers Ultimate... I don't know why it's doing that, but I don't care. But okay, you can actually redeem in voucher right there. But unfortunately, though, if you get a discount under like a fifty nine ninety nine in my Nintendo, there's also add on content right there. So as I noted back earlier, and we're gonna review that too after probably I'll just say episode six in the later future. And Fire Emblem Free Houses, that's a new Nintendo Switch game, and probably if you can play it as a value. Okay, so best-selling games. No, we don't need that. Thank you. Best-selling games. Which games are popular? If anything, that's like very popular. Now, Elias, I know, Elias and Joshua, I know, I know about bestsellers. So, tell us more about details about what games they could be playing here: Pokemon, Mario, or Zelda. Uh, other big games uh, released for the Nintendo system. Including third party, doing the third party games as Skyrim, for example. Yeah, yeah the Elder Scrolls yeah, Skyrim, of course. Uh, and the Luigi's Mansion Free did release back on October 31st in Halloween. You know about this, right? Yeah. Yeah. And also Cuphead. Cuphead did release April 17th. And prior to Jay, you know, you know about Cuphead games, right? Of course. Of maybe, I guess. I don't play Cupheads. Yeah. Well, Cuphead was originally an uh, Xbox exclusive, and it goes out to other platforms like PC and now the Switch, and also Ori and the Blind Forest. Also, The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild Explorers Edition right there is actually um, a sequel. It did release two years ago. I, I mean, well, yeah, it is two years ago, back in 2017. Mario Party, it did release back one year ago, and probably you could play that on the holidays, as long as you get a discount from my Nintendo. <laughs> also, the Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. Can you add, can you be able to play it as a for a discount when you play like a racing game? What do you think about that, bros? Yeah, I'd say it's the best one. I think it's the yeah. best one. So do I. I think it's the best one. Yeah. All yeah, right. So, huh? So go on. More about Nintendo Switch games and all about Nintendo Switch is that you always know you discovered the home gaming console that you can play anywhere. So, all right. So that's all we have for the greatest values for today. So keep on eye for more gaming suggestions and we're going to talk about Super Smash Brothers Ultimate. 
Later, episode seven, we're going to talk about Pokemon Sword and Shield. And I know it's a request from Joshua, so thanks for that request. So anyway, uh, guys, you. that's it for gaming suggestions. Until then, stay tuned for more as we come back with more with Privacy J and the rest of these two. So take us home. Elias, is your phone up? You raise it? Yes, um, you raise for it. So if you're gonna yeah, so if you're gonna subscribe for more content to Privacy J Productions and to Privacy J Productions Two, Facebook, Instagram, Snapchat, we'll let you know all about it. Facebook, my name is Jaden Garcia, and Instagram is JTech seven to seven. And Snapchat is Scoots all seven to seven. And thanks for watching. Peace out, and stay tuned for the next episode. It's episode six on the game suggestions. Tell them. Uh, okay. So uh, thank you guys for watching ep episode five. Oh. Uh, value battles and facts of gaming suggestions episode five. That's done for today. So we'll continue this gaming suggestions episode six. We'll think about it and we'll continue this brush along with Ultra Eric, along with Privacy J, and me and Joshua as two special guests. So uh, have a good night and we'll see you guys tomorrow in the morning. We'll continue this next year when the bros come back, Joshua. Uh, thank you guys for watching the Gaming Suggestions episode 5. We will continue on the support all track and Privacy J and Pri Privacy J Productions 2 and follow their Instagram, Twitter, and many more. And many more. So, see ya guys. Alright. Thank you, bros. Thank you, Privacy J. Until then, that's it.